We're following images coming in from Dallas at this hour where a large fire broke out burning several homes. Take a look at the images just as we came on tonight spreading to multiple homes at least five in flames. Firefighters trying to save the others there. Temperatures soaring there for weeks 104 degrees in Dallas late today. They broke several daily records in just the last week in a stretch of relentless heat of course helping to fuel these fires tonight and in the west at this hour the raging wildfire there the oak fire racing through the bone dry brush near Yosemite National Park. Flames already burning through 25 square miles. Nearly 6,000 people forced to evacuate homes already gone. The air tonight not safe to breathe. The smoke reaching the San Francisco Bay Area. This is the smoke from the wildfire seen from the International Space Station. And ABC's chief meteorologist Ginger Z is in the fire zone for us tonight. Tonight, the race to contain California's largest wildfire of the year. The Oak Fire igniting Friday in Mariposa County, already engulfing multiple structures and threatening more than 3,000. 6,000 people displaced. A crucial highway leading into Yosemite National Park shut down. Cal Fire bringing us to the battle lines. Well, that whole hillside, for example, was full, like torch, yeah. torch. As the flames climb this hill, they get higher and higher, and the firefighters have actually put in a dozer line where you can see that dirt there. That should stop the flames before it gets any higher. More than 2,500 firefighters battling steep terrain and heat to try to save the homes. And from above, an all-out aerial assault. And why is this place unique, and why is this happening now? This place is unique in the sense that this was devastated by the drought, and it had bark beetle infestation. And that bark beetle infestation created tons and tons of available fuel. This is the third wildfire in Mariposa County in just two weeks. The Washburn fire that threatened those legendary sequoias is still burning tonight. David, right where I'm standing, we are in exceptional drought. That is the highest level. Parts of the West are now seeing their driest stretch in 1,200 years. A 22-year mega drought that absolutely has to do with why these fuels burn so quickly in a fire like the Oak Fire. Now, there are a lot of other factors, land use and management. You have to talk about the bark beetle. But you can't leave out climate change. A recent study says that by the year 2050, we could see more uncontrolled extreme wildfires up to 30 percent, all due to climate change, David. And of course, we'll stay on this here. Ginger Z with us again tonight. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.